This morning, the Palin partnership, apparently a thing of the past. High school sweethearts together for 31 years, now calling it quits. Todd Palin, husband of former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin, filing for divorce on his birthday, just days after their anniversary. These court documents believed to be submitted by Todd cite incompatibility of temperament between the parties, adding they find it impossible to continue to live together as husband and wife, only their initials used in the filing. The couple has not responded to NBC News' request for comment. Governor Sarah Palin of the great state of Alaska. The first female governor of Alaska shot to political stardom in 2008, selected as Republican presidential candidate John McCain's running mate. Todd and I are actually celebrating our 20th anniversary today. Palin proudly sang Todd's the man she admires most. We met in high school and two decades and five children later, he's still my guy. Todd Palin, a commercial fisherman and champion snowmobile racer known in Alaska as the first dude, standing by his wife's side on the campaign trail. You guys are amazing. Thank you for uh, showing your support today. As Palin's political career faded, the family secured its place in pop culture. The only poll I care about is the North Pole. And Saturday Night Live even spoofing the pair. And what do you get when a renegade snowmobile cop from Anchorage gets transferred to New York City? Todd. The Palins with a reality TV show of their own inviting fans into their home. We both pitch in and, and do whatever needs to be done to raise this family and run a household. But their journey wasn't always easy. In 2009, there were rumors of affairs and impending divorce. A rep for the former governor at the time calling them all lies and fabrications. A snowmobile crash in 2016 left Todd badly hurt. An accident Sarah Palin addressed while campaigning for then-candidate Donald Trump. My husband was out snow machining, and thank you guys for your prayers for my husband, who is recovering right now in ICU after a little wreck on a snow machine, so thank you. Big wreck. The apparent divorce revealing private struggles for a once public political couple.